Hello, I'm Greg Robinette from Bowling Green, Ohio. I'm an at-large member of the Bowling Green City Council and full-time I'm a patent attorney with the law firm of McMillan, Zabanski & Todd. Hello, my name is Brian Kitchen. I'm here with the Wilkes County Republican Party. Um, I'm here with uh, Greg Robinette. He is a city councilman at Bowling Green. Thanks for having me here. Well, pleasure to be here. So the first question I have for you is, uh, what makes you conservative? Well, what makes me conservative is, uh, I guess I share certain ideals with other conservatives, that being limited government, limited and effective government, uh, individual responsibility, personal responsibility, and, and fiscal responsibility, especially at the local government level. Mm -hmm. Definitely. Um, and uh, what got you involved with the party? Well, I, I guess I've always been drawn to the service of some type. Um, I spent 32 years in the military, mm -hmm. and uh, when I moved to Bowling Green in 1995, I was looking for a way to get involved and started volunteering with the local Republican group and eventually moved from volunteer, uh, volunteer level efforts to uh, running for, for city council. Okay. And uh, with this, uh, this uh, next month, July, uh, having the 4th of July, um, what, what do you think would make uh, the 4th of July being a federal holiday different than other federal holidays? Well, I would hope, and, it, and it's the case for me, I, the 4th of July should be a time to, to remember how blessed and fortunate we are to be Americans. That we are the beneficiaries of the great courage of our founders. We had men and women who were prepared to die for that least realized of human dreams, liberty. Mm. And I think it's important to take a step back and and celebrate that, and celebrate the anniversary of the Declaration of Independence. Yeah, and you, you kind of touched on that a little bit, um, being some of the people that um, you know, were willing to die for this. Uh, what do you think makes American America's independence uh, different than other countries? Well, I, I think part of it is that we're a country founded on a set of ideas, mm. uh, not nationality or religion or ethnicity or geography. Mm. But a set of ideas that brings us all together, and um, you know, those ideas can be, you know, they can be summarized as simply as, as three words and phrases that appear on our coinage on liberty. You know, we we're a country where where everyone is free to pursue their dreams. Mm -hmm. um, the phrase "In God We Trust." We recognize that all of our liberties and rights come from our Creator, mm -hmm. and the phrase "E pluribus unum." From many one. I mean, those three ideas summarize, you know, what America is all about. But we're we're a country of ideas, mm -hmm. and I, that alone, I think, sets us apart mm -hmm. from other nations of the world. Definitely, um, that's very well very well put.